Um, is you, have you got your camera on? Yeah. Are you filming? Yeah. Give permission, really. You can't just go around filming people. Yeah, where are you going to, where are you putting it? Where Wherever you I want to. Without being disrespectful, you're, you're not that interested. No, Thank you, sir. Yeah. Oh, sh I forgot them oh. fing figures. <laughs> How you doing, man? You good? Yeah, I'm good, mate. You alright? Nice beard. <laughs> How much is the player? Uh, 25. 25, yeah? Thank you. How much are your trainers, mate? I don't think they're genuine. I'll give them to you for a fiver. I gave them like 25 quid for them. What makes you think they're not real? Uh, from a website I've got them from. A friend of mine linked it. <laughs> <laughs> I bet those are the, the Oswegos are real. The, what, these? Yeah. Yeah, they're real. Ugly, aren't they, Oswegos, though? Yeah, they come from the gym, though. I bet they are. I think they look alright. Well, I'll be, I'll, I'll be opening them up, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. Sound. No Thank drama. You, Thank you so much. Take care. Thank you. Hey, go on. That's half your car back. <laughs> they look fine to me. How much are your phones, mate? Uh, phone, um, four pounds. There's only, there's only that one. The, the other two base units, I don't know what happened to those. Oh, okay, okay. It's just that one. That's a shame. Never mind. Thank you anyway. Okay. No. I appreciate it. How much have you got? Three pounds. Three quid. How much is your wood block? Five. That one, yeah. Tom? Three quid. Oh, is that, is that a sharpener? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying, I'm not, he's already paid for it now, so what I mean is, that, yeah, but he'll buy that, I'll, I'll get him to do it for me. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Told you she was a miserable old bint, didn't I, eh? You lot said I was a cock. What did I tell you? The same woman from that thing last time when I said, Oh, the miserable old bint. Proved it. She is. Would you consider six for the pair? And the shoes? No? No. What about seven? No. Alright, thank you. Alright. Eight. That's five and three. So, no deals, no? No, no deals on that. How much, mate? You tell me. Oh, I don't bloody know. Did you do a quid on it? No. Two quid, yeah? Day, yeah? I'll try two quid, see if it likes, see if he likes it. Yeah. What can I say, eh? Hope you've got some change. Yeah, well always. Done. Always, mate. Yeah. Oops, oh, sorry, mate. Right. Well done. You was obviously meant to have it, it's a bonus. Right, There's the universe that. speaking. Alright, mate, that's what I do. <laughs> How much on your tonka, mate? Not Four gonna be quid. cheap, is it? Four quid. <sighs> It's <laughs> not the worst paint job I've ever seen anybody do. No, no, it's uh, not too bad. Depends what you want to use it for, really. Of course, yeah. Four quid, yeah? Yep. Can't say no to a bit of tonk, can we? I'll come and get that. I'm just gonna come over and see what else you've got on there. What are those on there? They rifle end holders. Uh, holders? Oh, yeah. How much are they? 25 each. They're all. What about these? Mm, five or each. No idea about stuff like that. I'm, in, I'm intrigued now. You've got some funky looking bits. And what about this? <laughs> I'm going to ask you for everything, by the way. Okay, the perfume or the forklift truck? This one, the perfume. Three, three pounds. Oh, I've got to buy that as well. Is there a box of it or is that just it? No, I used, I used the box. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> and how much is your train? 50. 50. Is that the. Yeah. I'm going to buy that as well. So four, yeah. five, six, seven. I don't mess around with you two boots, so if I'm, 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 I'm buying, I'm buying. I like people like you. Right. Get it done. Do you want to? Just quickly, because I've, I've, had, I've had the trick set before, but they, they perish quite quickly, don't they, some of them? This one hasn't. No. Hmm. Put that over here with this. Just so I can think about it, that's, is that 50 altogether, is it, yeah? Yeah. Okay. All seven. Is that Rossi 46 in it? Yeah. Know. How much is the Rossi one? Three quid. Three, so you want five each one. Think about that. What about the forklift truck? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be careful with it. Who's Andrew? The box is a bit 
go. Straight through. So I don't want to break it. No, 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 that's fine. I think it does yeah. lift off. There you go. It's the wheels on it. Shouldn't it just fall out? Yeah? No, it's just a bit of plastic. Okay, I'll let you put that back in there. So you want a tenner for that. So would you consider 50 for the pair? No. No? Uh, do 55 for the pair. 55? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, thank you. And then I owe you 55, 55, four for that, and then three for that, 55, 62 so far. Is that right? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. That's <laughs> okay. Right. Let me just put that in here. I want to try and put this somewhere without damaging it. That's that. Can't leave it here. Nah, 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 you're all right. Because what will happen is I'll disappear and forget. Okay. Well, I don't mind. <laughs> as long as you pay before you disappear. Yeah. I like that. <sighs> So we're on 62. I'll get some cash out in a minute so we don't get lost. 62. 62, 62, 62. Oh, I don't want to break Lips. that. It's a little so you press that one down, yeah. just in. Okay, Actually. there you go. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? Yeah. Let's spread this out there. 62. Let me just move this back for you. Know. 62. Hello, mate, you're right. David Dickinson. Yeah, I see, yeah. Yeah, I thought you could come out for a second. And how much? Oh, you got a little peacock feather in there, did you know that? No, it's just good luck, and they always do. How much are you asking for that one? 20. I'll be, I'm not saying it's not, but you know, you could just spray paint these on, yeah, couldn't they? Can, but it's not. No. Yeah, yeah, no, I wasn't, I wasn't yeah. accusing, I promise. <laughs> no, you're right, you could do that. That's what I mean, yeah, it's like, probably one of the biggest... I know, it's got, what is it, F&B, what is it? F&M, oh, no, no, that's it, it's just a little bit of spray paint. It goes up from a fiber, it's something Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let me get you some cash out. 62. Nice. Yeah, someone might have a use for it. Make it so you can have those too. That's just what I was about to say as well. <laughs> right, 70 quid. There we go. That was nice and easy for you, weren't it? And me. I ask a lot of questions, but it's because I'm thinking as I'm going, you see. No, that's fine. Do you have 10 change in there? Because I don't, I don't think I've got it. If not, I can, uh, I can go and hassle somebody. That is lovely. lovely. Thank you so Thank much. You very I appreciate much. that. Yeah. Well, hey, we're off to the races. I'll leave you in peace now. Thank you so much. Okay, mate. Yeah. What's that, Tom? <laughs> yeah. Who's Killer Queen? Oh, Katy Perry. Yeah. I believe it. I don't believe how much things are worth, though. Do you know what I mean? How much are you asking for the little things? 350. Yeah. See, that could be an absolute bargain. Yeah. Or it could be through the roof. I've got no idea. <laughs> Right, thank you so much, I appreciate it. Everyone's going to be telling me, you should have picked them up now. Thank you, bye. Well, mate. I did enjoy. <laughs> it was all a dream. I used to read yeah. Word Up magazine. <laughs> How much are you asking for that one? Oh, I'll buy that for a pound, I think. Right, let me go and see what else you got here. See if I can, see if I can spend a note instead of a coin. You've got some notes, then. How are you, mate? You're right. Yeah, not bad. Hello, Archie, yeah, Alfie. Alfie. Yeah, it's one of them. Yeah, it's one of them. It's an A. Yeah. It's an A. How's life? Yeah, good. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Well, unfortunately, it's only that. What's that, mate? I said you're not very loaded, Dan. Oh, I'm already oh, packed up, girl. I'll just drop some money down there. You'll find it when you pack up. Thank you so much. How's things, all right? Yeah. Keeping well. Mental. That. All right, loose. Yeah, all right. Oh, T.Y. Oh. Squish, Mamas and Papas. No, sure kind of a thing, isn't it? Jesus, what are you bloody you got on there? Monster High. Monster yeah. High, but I realised I won't film it. Ah, that's what happens. You can just film it now, can you, in the bag? Yeah. Well, I'll see you on the next wrap round. Yeah. Thank you, by the way. Is this unit in that, is it? No, my nan-in-law. Oh, bless her. It's good. Yeah. It's a little, little, little good. Good morning. Mm -hmm. How are you? Alright. How much is your pink flower light? Uh, 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 How much is that one? Hello, mate. You're hey, right. Mate, you keep sorry, him up. Yeah, That's yeah, all right, mate. Fiverr. Is it the American mm -hmm. version, isn't it? 
Yeah. How things what have you got? To, what have you got today? Ooh. Oh, train sets and all sorts. Nice little yeah. tricks. I saw it. I saw you jump the cage. <laughs> no, well, to be fair, yeah, kind of I did. Yeah, I was, nah, I, right. I was waiting. I was waiting with Tom, and Tom, but Tom had to guide me through. I got lost, and he didn't. There's a big road diversion, isn't there? I was on the bus, so it went around and came out the other end near the Hartfield. Yeah. So luckily, it's only a short walk. Around. Luckily, the bus driver knows where he's going. As you can. Right. Yeah. Cheers, dude. I'm empty now. Look, I'm empty. I've got no cash left. Gosh, no good telling me. This Have you ever seen anything like this? You're talking to me or somebody else? Well, me? No, you might know because you do a lot of reselling. It's part of the environment, but they're all the, it's all like the crown jewels. I've never seen anything like that before. Show this camera a minute. Anybody seen anything like that before? You let me know so I can let this boy know. Yeah. It's got to be worth something, isn't it? Oh, how much are you sending it to me for? I don't know. I, don't, I, just, I just wonder if you sort of... Can you show us? Have a look. It's just the Department of the Environment like on it. I don't know, it's all the crown jewels. If, if, if it's a good enough prize, I'll, I'll, I'll buy it for the whatever whatever of it, the novelty of it. It'll be worth a tenner, isn't it? Yeah. I've not seen anything like it ever. No, no. I'll, I'll, I'll Where pay... on earth did you get your hands I will, on that? I will pay a tenner for that. I'll, boob, I'll booby it. What's it called? Booby... booby what's it called? Me. I don't know. Booby prize it. I'm either going to lose a tenner or I'm going to make I a tenner. You, you think about all enthusiasts. Do you want to sell them for a tenner or not? Well, you can have it for Take a it for, I'll, I'll tell you what, yeah. What an unusual item. If you sell it for a thousand, I'd just be interested if to know. I, listen, if I ever sold that for a thousand, I'd come and find you. Yeah, give, you give, you never, me give you another tenner. <laughs> Yeah, royal. it's got to be. I, re I reckon that's some. I know I've got people at my work, that, um, a lady, and she would go crazy. It's got to be someone who's had access to it, isn't it? If they, if they are, or they could just be like something you, or they could just be something you could have bought in the museum or something. I've never seen anything like it. This is it. This is you don't know. Yeah, they're. they're, they're, they're I think they're probably just like slides that somebody's made for you to be able to go in. Because obviously it's a, it's a it's a slide viewer one, so it's either going to be museum or it's going to be archive or it's going to be. Yeah, yeah. We'll soon find out. I'll let you know. If, oh, I, yeah, if I make a thousand pound, I'll come and give you another five. Yeah. I don't worry. Yeah, I'll let you know as well. I like taking gambles and risks. Well, I'll go back for them clothes in a minute. Where's all the day? Sorry, I'm in your way. There you are, darling. What's up? You can't. Okay, Tom. How much are your shoes? I think I'll buy them. See if they're what size are they? Oh no, they're uh, yeah. No, they're a three. Sorry. Um, yeah. <laughs> they might be a bit too small, but thank you anyway. I'm gonna come. Let's have a look in this box. Is that right? Yeah, there's more shoes. He just pulled out a nice little bit of soap. I like the look of that. Cut it off some. Because too much for me, man. Oh, good, Can't handle it at the gym. Literally, literally cut it off for the gym. I'm not as cool as you, bro. You found anything, Sam? Mm. Oh, you got more there. Let's have a look. Oh, I've just trod on the thing. Oh dear. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. What uh, size? How's it going, my boy? You right? How much are these ones here? Yeah, I'll take them. So I owe you two. And what about these little trinket bits here? Another two pounds? Yeah, I'm thinking I'm, 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 I'm probably... Can I take all the Michael Jackson stuff? How much are you asking for that? Uh, Let me just fucking see more in the... I can't believe the way she's taking them out and just throw them on the floor. <laughs> well, I'll put a pile there and we can go from there. I, if we... I think it's like just... Fan books and stuff, whatever they call it. It doesn't matter about condition of them. It doesn't matter if they're like broken or stuff. I'd have to have a look in there at ten. I was, I, I did it um without looking first. I don't know. If I your sort of product, I'll have a look in there first. What about this tin? Okie dokie. Is that a tie pin, is it? Yeah. How much is that? It's a box. Yeah, no, I'm coming. Okay, I've got a little pile here. We're alright. We're going to be okay.
We're going to be all right. How much is this tea set? Oh, sorry, after you. You can't say no to pound. And the tea set? What did I say on this earlier? It's brand new, obviously. Four pounds, maybe? Yeah, I'll take it at four. Okay. I've completely lost it. <laughs> what's it, what's it, dude? I'm a non-stopper. Yeah, I'll take that. I like to make little piles, you see. I'm, I'm like a ferret. I just reckon I'd fucking be bothered with all of this kind of stuff. I just can't. Yeah. <laughs> see if I can empty it. I might buy that actually. <laughs> it's very pretty. I'm a bit of age too. I don't know if there's anything in there, but if there was, it's not now, just in case. Oh yeah, that lady put it on and put it away. Oh, okay. As long as nobody's stealing. <laughs> oh, there will be. Of course there will be, yeah. <laughs> Happens all the time, doesn't it, Boots House? Yeah. One of the most bizarre places I see theft is in charity shops. Yeah, that is strange. Okay, so I think we're good there for a minute, so I'll let you take your time. And then I think you said three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve. Uh, okay. So I don't really know much about that. I've got a five set up. Would you be willing to take fifteen? Yes. Yeah, is that all right? Thank you so much, I appreciate it. There's your money, I'll get bagged up. Lovely, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you for that, hope you sell out. Thank you. Very good. Is this your stuff up here? Vintage as well, yeah, please don't open it. Oh, I won't open it, of course head, not. Yeah. yeah, yeah, no, of course not. How much is it? Um, is you, have you got your camera on? Yeah. Are you filming? Yeah. Who are you filming for? Myself. <laughs> Why? You can listen, really. You can't just go around filming people. Of course you don't, it's, it's, a, it's a public place. Yeah, but it's like, I'm, I'm talking to you about something, it's a bit... Yeah, but, no, 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 I'm in, I'm in a public space. If, you yeah. want to you want to talk where to me about that though? Where are you going to where are you putting it? Where you Wherever I want it? to. Right, okay. If you're asking to go, that's okay. I'll leave your stall, no problem. <laughs> no, no, no. You're about being disrespectful. You're not yeah. you're not that interested. No, I don't want to be filmed. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. I'm yeah. not alright. But the thing is, you've just made it interesting. It wasn't interested before. Now it is. It's funny when she's cutting off. Oh, sorry. It was yeah, nice already. You got loads of clothes today, ain't you? <laughs> Good on you. Oh, you done well. Kind of. <laughs> If you, keep it as a you will do, yeah, darling. Thank you so much, and you. Mm -hmm. Sorry, mate, I'm on your way though. Whoa. There we go. Two bags. And some good bits as well. Oh dear. So that was an eventful car boot sale. I tried to focus on more higher value items today. I didn't want to fill myself with junk because as you can see, well you can't, but I'll show you, I've got so much junk in this place, it's unreal. There's profit in junk, there's money in junk, but I've got enough of it. I even brought some more today, unfortunately, but not a lot, that's the main thing. So before we dive into what I picked up very quickly, know your rights. Know your rights when it comes to filming in public. Unfortunately, when you're in public, you have no expected privacy. If you want privacy, go home, go to your car, even in your car, it better be somewhere on your driveway because you can't expect privacy anywhere other than your home. In some states in America, it's a two-party state where one person must give the other person permission and they both must agree that the filming can go on. In other states, much like the UK, it's one party. If I'm filming, so be it. Now, that being said, if you film in a shop, I'm going to stick to the subject, charity shops or even car boot sales. If the landowners, business owners, shop owners want you to stop filming, then you have to stop filming. Because at that point, you are then breaking their terms. And then of course, if they get really weird and say, you're filming, stop filming and leave, and you don't leave, and you don't stop filming, then it becomes a lawful side. Even then it's trespass to be fair, which is still a civil matter. But just know your stuff before you start piping off. All right, there's way more to it than that. Then I've just gave you a quick synopsis. You're allowed to film in public, whoever you want, wherever you want. Now in my videos, I'm always relatively respectful. If I see kids, I'll blur them out. If I see somebody who's vulnerable or something like that, I'll cut them out, blur them out, whatever else. Move the camera down, zoom in so you can't see them, all those kinds of things. But you today, lady, no, 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 no. You're about to get an education. Even the Romanian chap in the back, I think he was Romanian, 
He's not from this country. Even he was sticking up saying, he's in public, he can film where he likes. Because I can't, I don't know what accent that was. <sighs> Add it to the list of the Scottish and everyone else and the Welsh and sorry Romanians. Let's take a quick look and see what I picked up and I'll tell you why. First of all, I was never going to leave this behind. It was all a dream. Coogie bag. It's like a laptop, well, iPad bag. The thing is, it was a bit wet when I got it, but I put it in the same bag with the Tonka truck. That, that damage was not on there when I picked it up. So I've scuffed all the edges up. I'm so annoyed at that. So annoyed. But the classic Coogie colours, most of you will know Coogie from the sweaters. Paid a pound. Don't know what it's worth. Not a lot now, annoyingly. FIFA 19 for George, because he's still got a PS4 and he plays a lot of football. Don't know if he's got the 19. I think he's got like 22, though, and 23. So I don't know if he's going to care about that. But a little while ago, he was asking me for the old, old, old stuff. He wanted to know if his PlayStation could play like PS1, PS2, and he wanted all the old ones. So I thought we'll see if he wants that or not. He's probably already got it. The Tonka truck in question. Somebody has repainted this, and it's not the worst. It's definitely not the best either. I've seen... I've seen much better, but it's still a cool piece. I paid four pounds for that. I actually did a bundle deal on some stuff. I paid 70 pounds for a load of stuff. So, but let's do the 70 pound deal first. So we picked up this Tonka truck. I think I'm gonna get about 25 to 35 quid on that, I should imagine, depending if the arts class paint job does any, does any damage to it. Part of that same deal came this. Miniature perfume sets. We have in here, Ceruti 1881, Oscar de la Renta, Anais, Anais, I don't know, I've never heard that one before. Chloe and Givenchy. Paid, whatever, I don't know, yeah, 70 quid for everything. I think she wanted three quid for that originally on its own. Pally Toy forklift truck. I picked it up because, obviously, Pally Toy, they were the ones that was producing most of the early action men. So I guess this is around 50s, give or take. Battery operated, takes two batteries, not included. It's got somebody's name on there, Andrew. But it looks to be in relatively good condition. That's got Hercules on here. The other ones when I was researching, where it says Pally Toy, actually said Hercules. So I don't know if Pally Toy bought out Hercules and then just carried on bashing out their stuff or what, but it seems to be in okay condition. We'll soon find out when it comes to testing, which you will see in a later video. I think, again, the price on that's about 25 to 35. Sticking with the £70 deal, these two little pop, I don't know what, I don't even know what they are, pop pin, are they pin badges? Are they just like massive pin badges? I think they might be. We've got Shredder from the Turtles and we've got Zombie Captain America from the What If series of Marvel. And then of course the train set. So with that train set comes the Hornby signal cabin. If that's in good condition, 25 to 35 quid on that. Oh, what is that? It's in good condition, it looks really nice actually, but there's a little magnet swing person there. Ada's got actually some of these little square things, but she hasn't got any with people on it, so she'll like that. Yeah, it's in, it's in pretty good condition. Nice. And then, of course, the Trix Railway set. This is just a really nice piece. It's got... Oh, yep. Oh, come on, man. This has lasted so many years. Don't ruin it. Again, 50s. Actually, I've got a new thing. I can tilt this down, can't I? It's a train set, so it comes with the trains, with the coaches, and all the different bits and pieces in there. You've got the one coil of wire, six plugs, one bottle of Trix Shell Oil. The controller will be under here, if I can just get my finger under it. Okay, there you go. That's in there, thankfully. So yeah, I'll give that a good look over. It wanted £50 originally. Remember, I paid £70 for everything. With these, I've got no issue being a horrible, horrible guy and selling everything off individually. Obviously, I'll see if I can get it sold as one unit piece first. But if the price for that's only about 50 quid, I'm going to have to break it down. I had one before with different coaches and stuff in it, and it sold for mega money. So I took a chance on that one. Take a chance on me. But it's even still got the wax paper in there, you know what I mean? And then from... One lady, one deal. We picked up a vintage, the opening of Parliament Biscuit Tin. Another Huntley and Palmer's one. Buckingham Palace Tin. People like these kinds of things. I think it was Jess that got me onto selling tins about five years ago. A nice little electro-plated nickel silver biscuit barrel. Ceramic, just floral and... I mean, it's all right. I don't think it's worth too much. This is all from one deal. Some aromatherapy bar stuff. That's actually for me. William Morris, Lesser and Pavey, Strawberry Thief gift set so you got serving tray two little plates and two cups i think the cup set goes for about 15 i think the tins might be about 10 a region i think the biscuit barrel is about 12 to 15. avon rare rubies perfume i think i think they're going for about 18 quid quite a nice brutalist swank tie clip 
that was part of the deal as well probably about tenner on that some kitty clogs made in sweden these look like they've never been worn at all 125 recommended retail on there got the box got the papers got all sorts going on in there still all part of the 15 pound deal i think they sell for about 35 give or take depending on condition and style and i mean obviously we're a bit the wrong side or somewhere at the minute these lovely they look very sort of 60s 70s packages they're just a collection of elephants small to large made out of some kind of marble or granite type stone i'm hoping there's 15 quid there and a stack of michael jackson books my favorite one out of all of these is just the michael jackson theme book 1984 made in the usa there is one in there that's worth about 20 quid as well which is somebody's got this one listed for 30 pound listed doesn't mean sold it's like michael jackson in concert it's just a song books and pictures and posters are all in there still just a nice little collection she wanted 10 pound for the whole of them originally some woman was taking them out of the bag and just throwing them on the floor it's, it's making me livid but i gave her 15 pound for everything which is very kind of her and it's a good deal for both of us and then these i picked these up these are gazelle I did, I, did, I did research them. I'll put a screenshot up. She said, I'm going to be honest. I don't really think they're real, but you can have them for a five. And the first thing's first. <laughs> the nerve to say they're not real, but you can have them for a fiver. And secondly, they are not fake. There's nothing wrong with them at all. Absolutely nothing wrong with them. They're real. They're legit. They're sound. Everything checks out. They're perfectly made. Really good condition. The quality is fantastic. I don't know what she was thinking, but... I'll take them, my dear. RRP on these is over 100 quid. Pre-owned people are getting around about 60 to 70 quid. I paid five, so I'll probably aim for about 50. And unless I'm being a complete thicko, that is everything. I was being a complete thicko. Forgot to show you these, didn't I? These are slides of the crown jewels and stuff. You've got, let's see if I can show you up here. The crown, whatever else, all those, it's just whatever, but just pretentious shite. But... I paid £10 on them for a gamble. I've done some research. This company seems to be now doing like audio tour guides. So they'll like plug into your ears and give you a... You know that thing where you put your headphones on? These are older Department of the Environment, which is why I picked them up before. Oh, jeez. Crown Elizabeth Jewels, copyright 985. Just a load there. Paid £10. No idea on the value. Might only be worth the tenner I paid, if that. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And remember... Know your rights. In fact, if you want to check me, do some Googling about whether you're allowed to film in public and all the different kind of rules and regulations and rights and wrongs and caveats and loopholes and all those kinds of things. Let me know in the comment section down below. Let's have a debate. Love you all. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>